S R ninety three boxing back with a quick video. This is my post fight thought reaction to Andrew versus Sergey Kovalev. I watched the fight twice. Initially, I was kind of tired. I'm I live in the UK. Keep in mind, so I have to wake up at five. I can't remember exactly when I woke up, but it was like five or something. And I was watching the fight. I didn't watch the undercard to be honest, because I needed some sleep. <laughs> but I'll watch it later. Andrew Wood. Um, now I think Andrew Wood actually won the fight, 114-113. I gave him um, round 5, 6, 7, 8. I, I mean, anyway, I think 5 to 12. I gave him all round apart from 1, I believe. Basically, either way, I gave Andrew Wood 7 rounds. Kovalev 5 rounds, but one of the rounds, uh, obviously Kovalev dropped Ward. It was a great punch. You know, um... The reason why people think Andrew Ward won, and I can I have no problem with people thinking Andrew Ward won. It was a close fight. There was no losers. They both did really well. But the you know HBO commentary was bullshit. Uh, I mean, not everyone. Max Kellerman did a good commentary. Roy Jones Jr. did a good commentary. That Jim Plantley guy needs to get kicked out. He was shocking, shocking. Man, seriously, he's full of shit. That's the reason why people, some people would think, watching on on TV, that Kovalev won the fight. Score an official scorecards from uh, HBO was bullshit. Max Kellerman made a point on that. You know, Max Kellerman seems like a decent commentator, and so does Roy Jones Jr. But the rest of them needs to get kicked out. Um, now what do I think of? Um, well, before that, actually, I did predict all of this in my uh, videos. Kovalev will be better uh, outside range. He will do the in and out movement. And he will have to try and see Ward coming in and he does he has to catch him with the right hand as Ward is coming in and he did exactly that dropping Andrew Ward. Um so yeah. That that's really um what, it, what it, um and also uh, Andrew Ward will be good on the inside. I mentioned that and Andrew I said in the keys to victory that Andrew Ward has to go to the body while Kovalev has to uh, establish his jab and straight punches, move well. In and out movement, and you know they both did um, both of the uh, both did um, what I said they should do in the keys to victory. So I feel like my prediction was uh, pretty spot on. I said it'd be 50 55. I ne I always said that Andrew Wood, um, his chin is better than people give him credit for, and he showed that in the fight. So um, yeah, and you know what? a lot of times Sergey Kovalev landing punches, people would assume. Oh, he he's he must be landing the hardest punch because subconsciously that's what they think. And yeah, Sergey Kovalev's a harder puncher by a long way. But you know, as Andrew Wood landed those punches to the body, he roughed him up, tired out Kovalev. Kovalev, he didn't have that type of sting on the punches anymore. And Andrew Wood's punches seemed a lot more effective. Kovalev's punches uh, that was landing, Andrew Wood was kind of rolling them. A lot of times Andrew Wood was dodging them and missing them and he was blocking them as well. I feel like Andrew won the fight quite con not convincingly because I can see why people would think of the one. It depends what you like. But you know, Andrew Wood, in my opinion, won the fight. Do check out my prediction video to see how, how close I was to the... Um, uh, to uh, the outcome of the fight and also um what do you think is next for andrew or kovalev a rematch D drop in a comment sr93 boxing i'm out